Excuse me, what the heck is this? <laughs> video now I know it has been a minute it's been a good month maybe even two but your girl just had to you know sort out her mental a lot of things have changed as you can see but today we are back and what better video to be the first one back than Pretty Little Things latest collaboration with Tiana Taylor now your girl isn't just doing a collab with Pretty Little Thing she is now the creative director for Pretty Little Thing as well which I'm so excited about because I'm obsessed with the way Tiana Taylor dresses and now that she's gonna have input with their clothing I feel like it's gonna be amazing so I'm a little excited but I'm a little nervous as well about these collabs because we all know how collabs can go but if you guys are interested to see all of the stuff that I got definitely keep on watching please forget to like comment and subscribe if you enjoyed this video and let's do this guys I'm excited it's been a minute let's do this okay so we have this black bodycon dress which is completely cut out everywhere as you can see um it's just that normal bodycon material very comfy very kind of cute a lot cuter than what i thought it would be tiana of course looks amazing in this and this is definitely something i could see her wearing um very nice vibe obviously going with the vibe of the collection me personally i don't see myself actually wearing this out i do think it's nice and like i said i feel like it's a lot nicer than what i thought it would be but if i'm honest it's a lot going on <laughs> there's a lot going on so for me i'm still kind of in two minds about this one i definitely think it's cute if i really had a specific place to go um you know a really good place that could handle a dress like this i think it would be the perfect outfit but for now lockdown pandemic they ain't nowhere to go in this dress so it is a thumbs up from me i do think it's cute it's not the best quality like you can tell they haven't put used the best material but it's it's okay feel free to let me know what you guys think down below do you think i should keep it or should i return it and maybe hopefully wait until the lockdown's over and maybe find somewhere to wear this too so this dress was 20 pounds and of course 20 pounds is not a bad price but considering how cheap this material is i do think it is a little bit overpriced i picked up in a size 12 and it fits really good lengthwise considering how tall i am if you're new here and you're not aware i'm five foot eleven it's a really good length it's a nice mini um dress but it's not too short um for me to not be able to wear it but considering my whole arse cheek is basically out who really cares about the length you you know who, who cares because you're basically naked anyway do, do, do me i'm super fly super duper fly i can't stand the rain it's giving me 90s music video That's exactly what it's given, which, which I guess is a good thing because of course it's a 90s vibe um, look. I will show you guys the full tracksuit in a better angle, but yeah, this is a full leather tracksuit. You've got the little jumper leather thing, you got the little matching leather joggers, very, very 90s. I don't know if I'm a big fan of this. Like, I've been trying to make the leather joggers work. This is not my first pair of leather joggers that I have. I do own a pair and I've tried. I've really, really tried to make them work and I just don't think it's for me. Feel free to let me know what you guys think down below. I do like this whole vibe. I feel like the right girl can make this look amazing. Tiana is definitely one of them. I don't know if I'm not, to, I don't know if I'm not to par for this. I feel like this is a bit much for me. This was expensive. The total set is um, £65. The jacket, they call it, was £35. I got it in a 12. A little bit too big, but I guess it's supposed to be that kind of 90s oversized baggy vibe. And then the joggers, 12 again, fit great, and they were £30. So this isn't a cheap, you know, cord set, tracksuit. It's very expensive. I just think if you've got the right style, you can make this work. For me, I don't think I've got it. But let me know what you guys are thinking. 
Can I just say, really impressed with this dress. I didn't think I'd like it. Of course, because it's neon green and then it has New York kind of just here. I thought this really wouldn't be my vibe, but I actually think it's really nice. Again, length-wise, it is decent. It's okay. You can make it work if you're a tall girl like me, but um, it's not the best. It's this nice kind of thick knitted material. So if you are in a colder country, you're still gonna be cold, obviously, because it's a mini dress, but you're not gonna be super cold because then the material of the dress is really thick is it life-changing no do i feel like i need it desperately in my wardrobe no but it's okay so this dress was 20 pounds and i picked up in a size medium fits really well very nice and comfortable and i think for 20 pounds that is a very reasonable price the only thing about this collection with tiana taylor which upsets me is um i just wish there was a little bit more better quality pieces just a little bit more stuff that i think are more is more true to her style um especially with her being the creative director now i feel like she could have really gone hard with this collab and i think dresses like this are cute but it's not really what i was hoping for if that makes sense feel free to let me know in the comments if you kind of agree with what i'm saying but yeah okay so now we have this bodysuit again this whole like showing your side off is really in right now i'm starting to think because i've actually bought a top like this already but um i love this bodysuit the fit of it is not great i did pick this up this up in a medium or a 12 and i don't know if it's because i'm wearing my bra with it but it's just not fitting well like if i move in the wrong way you know the girls are going to be showing i absolutely love this whole um kind of print of like someone's bare chest um i wanted this same print in the dress but that was completely sold out when i went onto the website i feel like this is a really nice vibe very 90s i feel like if you was able to get the dress you have struck gold like that is going to be a really really cute outfit when we can finally go out and you know do our thing again um love this print love the color this was only 15 pounds and i actually got in a size 10 and i believe i got in a size 10 because all of the other sizes were sold out i think if i got in a 12 it would be a lot better fitting for me so that is a little bit disappointing but if this is still on the website and it's still in your size i think this is something that you should get um excuse me what the heck is this first of all this is just a hell no unfortunately i get the vision i get the vibe oh my gosh it's my thumb showing oh, I didn't it's mad see-through so i'm gonna come all the way forward so y'all don't see too much but um you just saw the length you just saw what was going on with this dress it's a big no from me i love the print i'm not here for full see-through dresses i'm just not here for that and if we are going to do a mesh see-through dress let it be black so i can wear cute black matching underneath stuff you know um so yeah i'm not really a fan of this but um and Tiana Taylor is literally sitting down with a big old coat covering this whole dress in her photo. And it makes sense because this dress is definitely way too short. And that's not just because I'm a tall girl. It's going to be short for anyone. I don't know what this strap is. I don't know if I'm wearing it right. If I'm not, but I'm not feeling it. It's very cheap. It's just, it's just a no. Feel free to let me know what you guys think. But if anyone is not agreeing with me on this dress, then I just don't know. I don't understand, chat. But for me, yeah, yeah, it's 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 a no. Um, this dress had the cheek to be eighteen pounds. No, it shouldn't have been eighteen pounds. It should have been like five. And um, I got it in a size twelve. Does it fit? Of course not. So um, yeah, no. Okay, guys, so that is it for today's video. As you can see, mm, I had a little mixed feelings. I'm really hopeful, and I'm hoping that this creative director position is actually like a real position in the sense that she's really gonna have a lot of input in what um pretty little thing does with their clothing this collab was okay i did miss out on a lot of stuff because i was a little bit late but um yeah i don't know you guys let me know what you guys think because that will help me out a lot i'm in two minds i don't hate it but i'm not in love with it either so yeah that's kind of where I'm at with it. But if you guys have enjoyed today's video, feel free to let me know by leaving me a thumbs up, commenting down below and subscribing to my channel. I want to thank you guys so much for watching today's video and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye guys. Mwah.